my name is Gerald Norbin. Um, I tried this 2019 Volkswagen Golf R here. It's got a HPA FR450 turbo kit on it. Pretty much everything else they have to offer. And we're here at uh, Mission Raceway today, the Rizzo Motorsports event, and uh, we're taking it to the track. I've always enjoyed racing growing up uh, through video games. Sim racing, Gran Turismo was always in my PlayStation when I was a child. And I always grew up fantasizing what it would be like to take a car, rip around at high speeds, feel the G-forces, and really own in on your skill and the mastery of the machine. So this growing up kind of like led me to pick a point in my life where I could buy a, buy a car, build it up, track it, push it, learn a lot about uh, how I want to push things, the skills involved, the technical uh, elements, and the hardware. We've got a VAD Pro installed as well for uh, onboard data and diagnostics and visualization and uh, we're putting it to the test. The VAD Pro is a really useful diagnostics tool on the street and on the racetrack because for me as an engineer, data is absolutely everything. If you can't prove it and you can't see it and analyze it and adjust for it, then you're not making progress, you're not making yourself better. You don't understand how your car is behaving or what, where the weak points may be or what you need to address. Whether it's at the street or the track, I'm using different parts of the VAD Pro to either view this data in real time or log it and, and I analyze it and send it off. Uh, for people to kind of diagnose and find out what's going on with the car. These different kind of screens allow me to view different parts of the car or customize the data that I'm collecting. Whether I'm at the street doing some, uh, some fueling logging or I just want to watch my boost pressure and the RPM. The VAD Pro fits in with the car's original aesthetics. It's very OEM feeling. You can still use your vent. It blows air and it just looks like it fits in and it was meant to be there in the first place. And I kind of wish Volkswagen made the performance monitor just as good as that. But now we have it anyways. <laughs>